Assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters, welcome to the journey of quest where we quench your thirst of knowledge. Did you know that you're constantly being pulled towards the center of the earth? It's true. We call this force gravity, and it's what keeps us from floating off into space. It's an invisible force, but its effects are felt by everything on earth, from the smallest pebble to the tallest mountain. Gravity is what gives us weight. It's why a feather falls to the ground, and why a ball thrown into the air eventually comes back down. The more massive an object, the stronger its gravitational pull. That's why the Earth pulls on us much more strongly than a pencil does. Think of gravity like an invisible rubber band connecting you to the Earth's core. The closer you are to the core, the stronger the pull. This is why astronauts in space experience weightlessness. They're so far from the Earth's core that the gravitational pull is much weaker. But gravity isn't just about keeping us grounded, it's also what holds our entire planet together, keeping it in orbit around the sun. It's a fundamental force of nature affecting everything in the universe. We owe our understanding of gravity to Sir Isaac Newton, a brilliant scientist who lived in the 17th century. Legend has it that Newton was inspired to study gravity after watching an apple fall from a tree. He realized that the same force pulling the apple down must also be responsible for keeping the moon in orbit around the Earth. Newton's law of universal gravitation states that every object in the universe attracts every other object with a force that is proportional to their masses and inversely proportional to the square of the distance between them. Simply put, the bigger and closer objects are, the stronger their gravitational attraction. Newton's discovery revolutionized our understanding of the universe. It explained why planets orbit stars, why tides rise and fall, and why objects fall to the ground. It also laid the foundation for many technological advancements, from launching satellites into space to predicting the movements of celestial bodies. But gravity isn't the only force at play on our planet. Earth also has a magnetic field, which acts like a giant invisible shield, protecting us from harmful radiation from the sun. Gravity's impact on Earth is profound and multifaceted. It shapes our planet's physical features, influences its atmosphere, and even affects the way life has evolved. Without gravity, Earth would be a very different place. One of the most obvious effects of gravity is its role in shaping Earth's surface. Mountains, valleys, and canyons are all sculpted by the constant force of gravity pulling on the Earth's crust. Gravity also drives erosion, as rivers and glaciers carve their way through the landscape. Gravity also plays a crucial role in Earth's atmosphere. The gravitational pull of the Earth holds on to the gases that make up our atmosphere, preventing them from escaping into space. This atmosphere provides us with the air we breathe and protects us from harmful radiation from the sun. Furthermore, gravity has influenced the evolution of life on Earth. Organisms have had to adapt to the constant pull of gravity, developing strong bones and muscles to support their weight. The force of gravity has also shaped the way plants grow, with roots anchoring them to the ground and stems reaching upwards towards the sun. Just like a bar magnet you might use on your refrigerator, Earth has its own magnetic field. This field is generated deep within our planet by the movement of molten iron in its core. These swirling currents of liquid iron act like a giant dynamo, creating electric currents that generate our magnetic field. The Earth's magnetic field extends far out into space, creating a region we call the magnetosphere. This magnetosphere acts as a protective shield, deflecting most of the charged particles streaming from the sun, known as the solar wind. Without this magnetic shield, the solar wind would strip away our atmosphere, leaving Earth barren and lifeless like Mars. The magnetosphere also plays a vital role in navigation, as compass needles align themselves with the Earth's magnetic field lines pointing north. The magnetic field isn't static, it constantly fluctuates in strength and direction. In fact, Earth's magnetic poles have flipped many times throughout its history, with the North Magnetic Pole becoming the South Magnetic Pole and vice versa. These flips are recorded in the magnetic signatures of rocks, providing us with a glimpse into Earth's dynamic past. The magnetosphere is a dynamic and awe-inspiring phenomenon. It's constantly being bombarded by the solar wind, a stream of charged particles constantly flowing from the sun. This interaction creates a complex and ever-changing environment around our planet. When the solar wind encounters the Earth's magnetic field, it gets deflected, creating a bow shock. 
much like the wave created by a boat moving through water. The magnetosphere compresses on the sunward side and stretches out into a long tail on the opposite side, extending millions of kilometers into space. Within the magnetosphere, charged particles from the solar wind get trapped in two donut-shaped regions called the Van Allen radiation belts. These belts are filled with high-energy particles that spiral around Earth's magnetic field lines, posing a hazard to satellites and astronauts passing through them. The interaction between the solar wind and the magnetosphere also creates stunning visual displays in the polar regions known as auroras. These shimmering curtains of light occur when charged particles from the solar wind collide with atoms in Earth's atmosphere, exciting them and causing them to emit light. While we can't directly observe Earth's interior, scientists have developed ingenious methods to study its structure. By analyzing seismic waves generated by earthquakes, they've pieced together a picture of our planet's layered interior, revealing a hot and dynamic world beneath our feet. Earth's interior is divided into three main layers, the crust, the mantle, and the core. The crust is the outermost layer, a thin rocky shell that forms the continents and ocean floors. Beneath the crust lies the mantle, a thick layer of hot, dense rock that makes up the bulk of Earth's volume. At the very center of our planet lies the core, composed primarily of iron and nickel. The core is divided into two parts, a molten outer core and a solid inner core. The intense pressure at the Earth's center keeps the inner core solid, despite its incredibly high temperature. The heat within Earth's interior comes from two main sources, primordial heat left over from Earth's formation and the decay of radioactive elements within the mantle and crust. This heat drives the movement of material within the Earth, creating convection currents in the mantle that are responsible for plate tectonics, volcanoes, and earthquakes. Earth's thermal structure is not just a static arrangement of layers, it's a dynamic system that powers many of the geological processes we observe on the surface. The heat flow from Earth's interior drives the movement of tectonic plates, creates volcanoes and triggers earthquakes, shaping our planet's landscapes and influencing its habitability. The convection currents in the mantle, driven by heat from the core, act like giant conveyor belts, dragging the tectonic plates across Earth's surface. This movement is responsible for the formation of mountains, ocean basins, and continents. It also leads to the creation of new crust at mid-ocean ridges and the destruction of old crust at subduction zones. The heat from Earth's interior also fuels volcanic activity. When molten rock called magma rises through the mantle and erupts onto the surface, it creates volcanoes. Volcanoes can be both destructive and creative forces, spewing out lava and ash that can devastate surrounding areas, but also building new land and enriching the soil with nutrients. Earthquakes are another manifestation of Earth's internal heat. The movement of tectonic plates creates stress along fault lines, and when this stress exceeds the strength of the rocks, they break, releasing energy in the form of seismic waves that shake the ground. Volcanoes and earthquakes, while potentially destructive, are also essential aspects of Earth's dynamic system. They are reminders of the immense power hidden within our planet, a power that has shaped our world and continues to influence its evolution. Volcanoes are not just fiery mountains, they are vents through which Earth releases its internal heat and pressure. They can take many forms, from gently sloping shield volcanoes that erupt fluid lava flows to towering stratovolcanoes that produce explosive eruptions of ash and gas. Earthquakes are a sudden release of energy stored in rocks along fault lines. They can range in magnitude from barely perceptible tremors to catastrophic events that can level cities and trigger tsunamis. While we cannot prevent earthquakes, understanding their causes and patterns can help us mitigate their impact and build more resilient communities. Both volcanoes and earthquakes are integral parts of Earth's geological cycles. Volcanoes contribute to the formation of new land and the recycling of Earth's crust, while earthquakes release stress built up by the movement of tectonic plates, preventing even more catastrophic events. Earth's gravity, magnetic field, and thermal structure are not isolated phenomena. They are intricately connected, influencing each other and shaping our planet's environment. Understanding these complex interactions is key to unraveling the mysteries of our dynamic world. Gravity plays a fundamental role in maintaining Earth's thermal structure. The gravitational pressure at Earth's core is immense, generating the heat that drives the convection currents in the mantle. These currents, in turn, affect the movement of tectonic plates, 
shaping Earth's surface and influencing its magnetic field. The magnetic field, generated by the movement of molten iron in Earth's core, is also influenced by the planet's thermal structure. Changes in the flow of heat within the core can affect the strength and direction of the magnetic field, leading to fluctuations and even reversals of Earth's magnetic poles. Furthermore, Earth's thermal structure affects the distribution of heat on the surface, influencing weather patterns, ocean currents, and the distribution of life. The interplay between these forces creates a complex and dynamic system that makes Earth a unique and habitable planet. As we delve deeper into the workings of our planet, we gain a greater appreciation for its intricate balance and its vulnerability. Earth's gravity, magnetic field and thermal structure have shaped our world and allowed life to flourish, but these systems are also susceptible to disruption, reminding us of our responsibility to protect our planet. Human activities, such as burning fossil fuels and releasing greenhouse gases into the atmosphere, are altering Earth's climate, potentially disrupting the delicate balance of its systems. The consequences of these actions can be far-reaching, affecting weather patterns, ocean currents, and the distribution of life on Earth. Understanding the interconnectedness of Earth's systems is crucial for developing sustainable practices that minimize our impact on the planet. By studying Earth's gravity, magnetic field, and thermal structure, we can gain insights into its past, present, and future, helping us make informed decisions about our relationship with our home planet. Protecting Earth is not just a scientific imperative, it's a moral obligation. It's about safeguarding the future of our species and preserving the beauty and diversity of life on our planet for generations to come. As we continue to explore the wonders of our world, let us do so with a sense of responsibility and a commitment to ensuring its well-being. Thanks for watching us share our videos. Subscribe our YouTube channel and press the bell icon and stay curious for new uploads.